just open the door. Anyone can do it. Who wants to open the door? I'll open the door. I think I'll open the door. No god responds to me. We do have a sometimes. I mean, like, I have one. Wait, don't you the god that is missing. The god that is missing. I'm not smoking anything. Okay. Why? Don't eat rice, kids. Hello, and welcome to Boston, a game of D&D played by liberal arts students. I'm Jack Dagan, your DM. Now, let's meet our players. Hello, my name is Drew Fawcett. I'm an, a student at Emerson College. I'm Jessica, student at Emerson College. Wow. I'm Ella, student at Emerson College. I'm Karthik, student at Emerson College. <laughs> uh, I'm Reed. Uh, Student at Emerson College. <laughs> we all go to wow. Emerson College. Yes. That's phenomenal. All right, and now our players, a uh, little warning, they're not the most experienced. <laughs> they might make some mistakes, but you know what? Their heart's in it, and they're going to give it their best shot. Yeah. So with that, let's get into the world of Boston. All right, we descend into the mythical, yet strangely familiar world of Boston, a city that is full of all the wonders of technology that we know and rely on, but is also full of fantasy. Magic permeates this seemingly modern city as sorcerers fly through the sky on their morning commute, unicorns graze in the public gardens, and nobody bats an eye at the drunken cyclops sleeping in the middle of Newbury Street. The city, which is always a bustling metropolis, is charged with even more fervor than usual as it is that time of year again. The annual Fibbage Tournament, a legendary competition that pits the city's most renowned adventuring colleges against each other to see which one will reign supreme. Who will it be this year? The Paladins of Harvard? The Wizards of MIW? Maybe Barbarian University, or Emerson College of Sorcery and Special Effects. Regardless, our story is not about that tournament. Our story is about the tournament's prize, the Goblet of Fibbage. But more specifically, the freshmen who come from all different schools that have been assigned to guard it on this particular day. With that, let's meet our actual characters. Let's see, who wants to go first? Everyone roll a d20. At the same time? Yes, at the same time. Wow. Can we, oh, <clears throat> Two. I can't. Eight. What did mine say? 17. 14. All right, we're going to start with five. Ella's character. All right. We zoom in into a, a Newbury Street boutique, a very high end fashion store where Ella's character is shopping. Ella, would you like to introduce your character? Uh, my character's name is Enril. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I am at a high fashion boutique and I'm looking for a new pair of pants because I have a big party coming up. All right. All right. So where do you go in this boutique to look for some pants? Probably the pants rack. Uh, the pants, wa Sorry. pants rack? What color yes. pants are you looking for? I'm looking for a pair of bright red, I think. All right. Well, let's, let's roll an investigation check to see if you find a pair of bright red pants. Let's do that. All right. So roll a d20. Six. Oh, six. Oh, add your uh -oh. investigation. Maybe that'll save you. <laughs> Seven. Seven. All right. <clears throat> so much better. Um, you know, you're having trouble, Ella. You're having trouble finding the pants that you're looking for. You find some blue pants. You find some, even some yellow pants. You, oh. you find some pants made out of dragon scale, which seems odd that they're in this section. Wow. Um, but you're not finding any red pants. But you do see uh, uh, a, uh, someone who worked at the store stalking in the corner, if you want to ask them. I think I'm going to ask them, because I really want my red pants. OK, so yeah. you walk up. What do you say to this, to this assistant? Hi, um, I was just wondering, do you have any red pants? <laughs> Pretty good. So the assistant, who's a uh, little older than you, looks to be in her early uh, or mid-20s, uh, is a human. She turns to you and says, oh, um, if you look right over there and you see to the exact same section that you were looking, and, like on display right in the center is a pant, is like three different pairs of red pants. Oh. Uh, you have no idea how you missed them. Oh. Whoa. I'm but, so uh, stupid. Wow. No, you're, you're not, not. You're not stupid. You're not stupid. You're, not stupid. you're, you're great. Not. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> All right, so you look over uh, the pants. She says, uh, those pants, though, um, they're about the most expensive thing that we have in the store. <laughs> Good thing I'm rich. <laughs> that's Okay, that's a bold statement to make. But okay, would you like me to ring the pants up for you? Yes. All right. 
So she goes over, she grabs any pair of, what size? Um, small. Small? <laughs> All right. So she goes over, grabs a small pair of the red pants, uh, brings you over to the cash register, and she, she rings you up. She says, all right, that'll be 3,000 gold pieces. Uh, do you have that? Do you, do you have that much money? I'm a little short. You're a little short? Mm. Mm. How short are you? 3,000. <laughs> 3,000. <laughs> I thought you said you, she, the, the shopkeeper looks confused as you hesitate. Didn't you say you were rich? Yes, but not in that type of money. <laughs> in, in what type of money? Like shells. Sh <laughs> shells. Oh. Yes. Sand dollars? I've heard of that. Sand yeah. dollars. I yeah. heard that Sand dollars. more like... Well, do you have... Do you have a, we take credit as well. Do you have a credit card? Uh, I do. I do. Okay. So, so she reaches out and she takes her credit card. She rings it up. It's approved. Daddy's money. Perfect. It's coming in. Yes. It's coming in God. handy. God bless. All right. Um, I love my daddy. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. And um, as you do, uh, and she's uh, she's putting in a bag for you to take. Um, you feel a vibration in your pocket as your phone goes off. Uh, you see on the on your phone screen an, uh, an alert that you put in a little while ago as a reminder. Uh, you have a place to be in about fifteen minutes. Where is it? Where are you going? You guys want to know where I'm going? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, oh yeah. Well, they're not not—they're not here. Oh. Mm. But you can tell them well, and then the also tell me. Well, yeah, I'm interested. If in you really story. want to know where I'm going, I'm going to my aunt's house. <laughs> you're going to your aunt's house? Yeah. You're going to your aunt's house and then you're going to the state house? Yes. Perfect. Is that your aunt's house? Oh, your aunt works there, right? Yes, yes. Okay, perfect. It's yeah, she has, she house. has, a basically, <laughs> she's like, yeah. Okay, so you leave the store on your way to the state house. Thank you, NREL. All right, everyone roll your d20s again, except for Ella. Okay. All right, who's got the highest? 18. Ooh, that's Reed. All right. We descend on <clears throat> Reed's character. Reed, do you want to describe your character walking through the Boston Common? Yeah, so, stylish guy, my, my character's name is Ascend, mm -hmm. or As for short, A-Z. Cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Um, he is an Air Ganassi. Mm -hmm. Uh, sorcerer, walking through the common, you know, with his camera, getting some good shots of, you know, squirrels, nature, just trying to, just trying to get some, some good cinematography, gotcha. you know, just right. some nice footage to look at later. Makes sense. Where, where does your character go to school? Uh, he goes to Emerson College. Mm -hmm. Emerson College? Yep. I'm sorry, uh, where, where did your school, where was your school? Oh, again? it's just like, it's just a small school, um, Harvard. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, okay. that, uh, yeah, no, okay. I don't, they don't like that. It's pretty small, I don't know if you guys... Know. Okay, it makes sense. Okay. A lot of stuff makes sense now. All right, so walking through the common, you see several different things going on. You see some children over playing in a fountain. Mm -hmm. You see uh, a squirrel trying to break into a nut. Um, and you see uh, a little boy playing with a dog. Oh, yeah. So what do you do? I walk up to the squirrel. Okay. <laughs> I pull out my dagger that I carry with me. Okay. okay. And I grab the nut from the squirrel. He trust me, I guess. Should I be talking <laughs> to the first it, person it, here? <laughs> yes. You okay. Can, yes. Make an animal handling check to see if the squirrel is willing to give you his nut. <laughs> All right. Eleven. Eleven. Oh. All right. Should do I you, add do you have, do you have an, uh, anything to add to that? Oh, animal handling. I've I have one. Uh, right. I have so 12? twelve. Okay. Yeah. So we're talking Boston Common squirrels here. Mm -hmm. So they're a little braver than weird regular squirrels. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Yeah. this squirrel seems used to strange things and strange people. So it's okay. willing to give you its nut. Okay. It's willing to play this out. So he's sitting there while I'm while I take his yeah. his nut. He's just waiting he's just watching it. So he's I like, have I have the nut, I put my dagger on it, and I whack the top of the dagger and it perfectly cracks the nut, and I hand it back to the little squirrel. Aww. Aww. Yeah. Uh, An ally. He likes animals, everyone. Yeah, I like um, animals. All right. Uh, do you, wh wh what do you do next? What are you doing? You have you have some time to kill before you got to be at the state house. <sighs> what else was happening? I don't know, there camera? was the oh there were the kids playing in the fountain. They were running around having a grand old time, mm. and then there was the kid the the boy with his dog. What happened to his dog? He, he, nothing. He's just, just, he's he's just with his with dog. dog. Um. All right. Do I do I am I carrying dog treats? <laughs> Is that a thing for me to roll carry? to carry dog treats? Okay. Perfect. 13. <laughs> no, you're not carrying any dog treats. You okay. forgot them. You have then them at your house. I film, you I usually film... do, but not today. All right. I shoot with the camera. Okay. <laughs> I think I... The kid's dog. Oh. Okay. Okay. 
Gotcha. Like, oh, you record. Yeah. Verified that it was a camera. I would have thought it was a gun. Yeah. yeah. I know. Yeah. I get it, guys. All right. Right. Roll, roll a performance to see if it's a good shot or not. Roll a performance to see if it's a good shot. 20. Oh, oh natural 20. Oh, wow. That, wow. that right. is a good yeah. shot. All right. That's right. You're going down. So, yeah, that's so, a good shot. All right, so you kneel down. Yeah. You take your camera. You look through the lens. And you're just like, yeah, that's and you that's it. take the shot. Nice. This this shot, it could be in National Geographic. It nice. could win awards. Oh god! Nice. It wow. is it is the shot, the money shot. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, Jack. <laughs> okay, DM. Um, and with that, you stand back up, very satisfied with your work. All right. Great job. <laughs> that was me flipping the viewfinder. The viewfinder. Yeah. Okay. A little screen on the side. All right. We got that. No. Thank you. All right. Next. What's your next step? My next step? Um, well, now that I have that shot, I mean, I just keep walking. You just keep walking? Yeah. All right. So in what, you're walking in what direction? Towards the state house? I, yeah, I'd say towards the state house okay. because I have to go there. What do, you, what, do you want to walk through the common? Do you want to walk on the sides next to one of the streets? Um, I'd walk through the common. Which way? Through the common? Every once in a while stopping to kneel down and talk to the squirrels. Not talk to them, but you got what I mean. Okay, just interact Social, with them? So, yeah, interact. All right. with the squirrels. So Az is just ambling his way, taking his time, getting to the, to the, to the state house. Mm -hmm. Just stopping at several squirrels on the way and just having a grand old time. Yeah. Just enjoying life, really. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Az. Um, all right. The three remaining. Roll your d20s again. Whew. I'm nervous, guys. A four? <laughs> what, oh. What did oh, I get? Ten. Four, four. All right. Ten. ten. We find ourselves in a North End restaurant oh. with a certain human barbarian having lunch with her boyfriend. Oh. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Jess, would you like to describe your character? Um. Well, my name is Michelle, and I am a barbarian. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I love cheerleading. I love school. School spirit. You know, I go to BU. Uh, terriers. Go terriers. Boston terriers. Okay. Boston terriers. Well, yes. Okay. Boston terriers. Wonderful. That's me. All right. Uh, sitting across from you is your boyfriend named Licorice. Um, yeah. He's a human. He's, uh, he's pretty, he's, he's, he's a looker. You snagged a looker. Um, yeah, I did. Which is to be expected of Michelle. Um, and he is just chomping on some pizza. Like, he's just, he's really digging into some pizza. Like, it is the last thing he's ever going to get to eat. Yeah. <laughs> Michelle, what are you eating? What did, what did you order? I got pasta. You got pasta? Just regular pasta? Just butter and pasta? Well, with Alfredo sauce. With Alfredo sauce, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And what are you talking to your boyfriend about? I'm just complaining about all the other girls at school. Okay. What, who, like in my dorm. Gotcha. Who specifically? My roommate. Oh, your roommate? Yeah. He's, so Licorice looks up from his piece and he says, what about your roommate, babe? He does, yeah. He says that. <laughs> what, <laughs> what, um, what do I say to him? I mean, I don't want to like expose her or anything. Ooh. But pretty much she just like is really messy and like puts all her clothes on my bed and stuff. You should talk to her about that. I have. You have? Mm-hmm. She just doesn't seem to respond. If anything, she gets mad and she puts more stuff on my side. Well, why don't you just like threaten her with your axe? You do that a lot with other people. I have. You, and she didn't stop? She did, she stopped for a while and then she forgot about the threat. Oh. Yeah. You should just threaten again then. Okay, I will. Okay, I'm glad. Yeah. I'm gonna get back to this pizza. Okay. All right, so <laughs> we leave a very pleasant afternoon as Michelle and her boyfriend Licorice Enjoy a meal before Michelle reports to the state house as well for guard duty. Now, you two. Final showdown. Oh, it hit, oh they hit each other. 20, 20 and a 17. Good, good job, man. All good job, man. right. <clears throat> All right. Um, we look at a back bay sidewalk. As walking down the street, we find a gnome and a fire gun. A rock? Say, a rock gnome and a fire gun. Say, Karthik, would you like to describe your character? Uh, hello. I'm Lopez Reese. I go to, uh, Berkeley. I'm Bard. NBD. Not a big deal. Um, I guess you can say that I'm a musician. Um, <laughs> and today okay. I'm walking back my bandmate, Jetfire, and we're rehearsing for Battle of the Bards, and I just don't think it's going too hot. You don't? Okay. Jetfire says what? 
why do you th- why don't you think it's going well i don't know dude it's like i feel like every time i'm strumming a chord you're out here creating dissonance what what are you what are you talking about dude all i'm saying is like is this a one sec i'm pretty sure i have a spell for this is this a <laughs> where's my dissonance spell <laughs> Either way, <laughs> this isn't a dissonance spell thing, bro. Let me just, just just learn the music, man. We have some great tunes. We have some great tracks like Dungeons and Bitches, <laughs> DDs on my BBs, oh. uh, and then For the Troops. Okay. That's a good. classic. That one's classic. But I don't know. I just don't think we're going to be um, ready in time for Battle of the Bards. It's kind of bringing me down, actually. Well, man, if you, if you think it's me... I promise I'll rehearse more. I'll yeah, really right. get into my, to my accordion. Sure. I promise. I'll, I'll, I'll sleep with the accordion. You will? I'll live and breathe the <laughs> accordion. Promise? I promise. Sure? I promise. Okay. I swear. I swear to you. Okay. All, All right. right. We'll see what happens. Uh, and you also, at this moment, feel a vibration in your... Fo- in, in your... Not... <laughs> in my pocket? In your pocket. Oh, what? Oh. <laughs> and you pull it out and you see... You also have a reminder, a official alert... That you need to be, you are expected at the state house in 15 minutes. Can I, okay, 15 minutes. All right, so are you sure you're going to rehearse? Yeah, I promise. I, pr- I promise I will rehearse. All right. That accordion is, we're one and the same now. Dude, if we don't win Battle of the Bards, you're out of the band. Oh, God. You're, you're not serious. I'm serious. What, did you talk about this with the others? No. I'm the leader of the band. I think it's pretty expected oh my God. that I get to make these decisions. Oh my God. That's kind of harsh. Yeah. I'm sweating. I mean, oh, okay. I kind of get it, though. Yeah, I get it, too. He's not, He's not practicing. He's not putting in the work. Yeah, team saying. spirit. All right, so Jetfire, he looks really shaken up. Like, you've, like you've, you... You heard his feelings. You've rattled his cage. Yeah. And he looks at you and says, Okay, I, I, pr- I swear to you, we will be prepared for Battle of the Bards. All right. All right, and you make your way Guess off so. to the state house. Yeah. Zooming in on our final character. Hello. Chilling on the bus, already headed to the state house because he doesn't need an alert to be on time. I'm on top of my stuff. My name is Manny. I'm a druid. And yeah, I mean, I'm a preppy boy. I like to dress nice, dress clean, dress well, <laughs> and I'm I'm on top of my game. Good mm-hmm. grades. I think I uh, I got a good shot. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, you feel a vibration also okay. in your pocket. You pull it out. It's not an alert. It's a call from your mom and dad. Okay. I'm going to take this, guys. I'm sorry. Hello. Manny. Hello. Do you not know? What it's seems a- to be the problem? <laughs> <laughs> um, Manny, we just got an alert here. Um, it says that uh, your GPA has dropped below 4.0. <laughs> <laughs> Is this some kind of prank? I'm sure that can't be correct. <laughs> We got an official alert from your college, Tufts University. Um, oh, it says in your transcripts that your GPA is no longer 4.0. We okay. discussed this. If this were to happen, this would be a catastrophe for your future. I'm, I, I promise you, sir. I, 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 I don't know what happened. I am, I'm I mean, as confused as you are, to be, to be you honest. Hear in the, you hear in the background your, your mom's voice. It's your dad that's on the phone. Are you telling him that he's going to be kicked out of school if, he, if, he get, if it drops a point below? Um, and, and your dad says, yes, 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 I'm explaining the situation to him. Okay, I, I swear, I'll get, I'll get right on it. I'm so sorry. Something must have gone wrong in this system. Manny, you or... know that we take academics very, very seriously in this household. I know, I know. All right, so we expect you to do better from now on. I, w- I, w- I will. You can't let this happen again. It won't, it won't. Classic. School is the most important thing in your life right now. It is, absolutely. You're, you're correct Above about everything that. else. You, are, you yep. don't have a girlfriend, right? I t- don't. We talked about this. We, yeah. We... You're not allowed to have a girlfriend. I know. I definitely do not have a girlfriend. Do you have, how many friends do you have? Um, two smart friends. Okay, that's too many. <sighs> Just count it down to one. Understandable. Okay. I completely, and I, I will fix the GPA. It will never be like this okay. again, I swear. I promise. Oh, you promise. I, I promise. All right, because remember, if you get expelled from school, you don't get to come home. All right, love you, son. Bye. Goodbye. Then they hang up. <laughs> Sorry. Wow. Sorry about that. Kid. I'm actually a tutor, I feel like. I'm like really smart. That's I'm a really... tutor if you need something. Okay, thank you. All right. Now, we zoom out and come together as our five different characters meet at the state house. You all arrive at slightly different times. 
at the glorious Boston State House. Boston, Boston State House. Boston. I can't be the one to mess that up. No. <laughs> um, I know. All right, so we arrive at the Boston State House. Um, you walk through the grandiose doors oh. up to a reception desk that says, um, uh, there's a little placard that says, for those reporting to guard duty this way. You follow it to, uh, to a small room, which seems to be towards the back of the State House. Uh, it seems to be just a waiting room. You, Manny, are actually the first to arrive. You, you walk in. You're, you're waiting around. You're a, little, you're a little not upset because you've come to expect it. Your, your, your punctuality is not common. Mm. But uh, you, you kind of wish that your fellow, your fellow guards were, were arriving at the same time. They show up. Yeah. yeah. All right. The next to arrive is, of course, Az, who was pretty close. So it wasn't really hard for him. Although close. he was borderline late because he stopped so many times to, to speak with the squirrels. Um, so you amble in, you see, you see this, uh, Eric Ganassi, very light blue skin, walk in with a camera, looking, look, looking like a kind of an interesting personality. Very, very not you. Yeah. Um, uh, you have, there are several seats open. Uh, Manny is sitting on, uh, Manny, where are you sitting if there's five open seats? I'm sitting directly in the middle. Directly in the middle? All right. Where do you sit? I sit next to Manny. Right next to Manny? I'm, I'll be bored if I sit by myself. Okay. okay. Um, what, uh, are you just sitting next to him? Yeah. All right. I'm like, what's up? May I respond? Uh, of course. Of course. Uh, I, well, I actually left a space in between if you didn't want to sit uh, directly next to me. But. Oh, I was just, I was just wanted to talk, just hang out to see what's up. Because, like, I know this can be boring, and I was just, like, it's pretty bored. I wanted, I wanted to show you. I took some shots in the comment if, you, if you're interested in, like, film or anything. Oh, like, um, like a, on a camera? Yeah, like on a camera, like this one right here. Like, see. Oh, wow, that is a that is a good picture of a dog. Yeah. And at that moment, <laughs> like Michelle it? walks in, seeing these two boys talking about apparently a very good picture of a dog. Michelle, what would you like to do? Wait, can I see the picture? <laughs> yeah. Look. Let me flip the flip the camera around. Oh wow, that's a all great right. picture. And as all right, and all three of you are crowded around this camera looking. Enrel, you walk in. Hello. Hi. Hi. We're looking at a cool shot I just took in the comment of a dog. Really? Yeah. Do you want to see it? it? Yeah, look. Okay, Lopos, you walk into four people crowded around a camera looking at a picture of a dog. I love that picture of that dog. He looks so happy. I wonder what kind of dog it is. I'm allergic. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. You, you well, know, it's, dog, just, it's, it's just a picture. picture. Yeah. It's just so, a picture. <laughs> you can't enjoy a picture? I... You know, it's a picture. Well, I can't even see it. I'm pretty short. Can you guys just like... Yeah, let me lower it down for you. Okay. Now it's on the floor. Lobos, yeah. Lobos how you tall are you? I'm, I'm like two feet. Oh. oh. Okay. So a little rock now. Yeah. yeah. I'm, okay. a little, I'm a little. I'm you're a little, little rockster. Guy. You are. You're a little. Oh okay. uh, wait, what is everyone's names? Oh, my name is Manny. Manny. Michelle. Michelle. Enro. Enro. Ascend. Ascend. Are you an Aragonasi by any chance? I am. Yeah. You know, I've been thinking about writing a, writing a song called Aragonasi looking as. <laughs> oh, like oh. me. <laughs> yeah. That'd be sick. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's great. I All right, as you're that. discussing oh. potential <laughs> musical collaborations, um, a door towards the back of the room, not the door that you entered from, bursts open and in walks a very interesting looking fellow. He is a basically a humanoid hippopotamus walking on two legs. Um, he's standing about nine feet tall, but even though he's very large, very hippopotamus-like, uh, He's not very threatening. You, you don't feel particularly threatened by this fellow. Uh, he's, very, he's wearing a very official uniform that's kept immaculately clean. Okay. Um, he looks at you, um, his eye accented by a single monocle. Um, and he says, finally, you've arrived for guard duty, correct? That's yeah. correct. Yep. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's, yeah. yeah. I, we yeah. expected you, or all of you, I did notice. Your punctuality. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Of course. Uh, we expected all of you five minutes ago. Do you know how important the object you're guarding is? We know. No. Yeah, I, just, I actually don't. I mean, yeah, I was one minute late. Hey, hey, it's really important. It's, we know. It's important. Yeah, it's really important. Well, then I would appreciate punctuality if you ever have to do this duty I again. I like punk okay. music. That, that's not what he means. Just say understood. That is not what I mean. Follow understood. Follow my lead. Understood. Okay, understood. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Understood. He's a little bossy. Yeah, all right. I really like him. Come on, him or him? Him. him. I don't really like him. Good, so we're in agreement. 
Would you stop discussing amongst yourselves? We have guard duty to Sorry. get to. Sorry. I to pick up my yeah. camera still. All right. He turns around and walks through the door that he came in and says, follow me. All right. So you guys follow him into the next room and you see uh, a little, his, what a, appears to be a very oversized secretary desk that, that you can only assume is his own um, that leads into a larger room that with vaulted ceilings, um, carved marble floor, just really, really, really beautiful. Something that you would expect to see in a palace. You don't even know how this can fit inside the state house. There must be some magic involved. Especially here in Boston. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's what that I'm saying. Truth? And in the center of the room, on a raised dais, is the object that you are guarding, the Goblet of Fibbish. The Goblet is a Baroque piece that forces you to stop and stare. While the base of the Goblet is clear glass, the thin, delicate stem has seven gold vines snaking up the sides. Weaving but never crossing until they reach the bowl of the goblet. On the wide rimmed clear glass bowl rest seven oval jewels, oh. individual and ornate around the top of the bowl. It is truly a prize fit for the champions of the Fibbage tournament. That is the I most like beautiful that. thing That's I've ever so seen. That's so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. I want to write a song about it. He says, uh, the hippopotamus man turns to you and says, please do not. Why not? We expect the reputation of the of the goblet and the tournament itself to be held to the highest esteem. I don't know if one of your punk rock songs would be appropriate for this setting. I'm sorry. Man. What if it was like pop rap? I'm unfamiliar with pop. I don't think he's going to get rap. it. He's not going to get it. Okay. That's kind of uncultured. Now, did your schools did your schools inform you about your specific duties with guard duty? Yes. No. no. They did. Uh, I mean, they could have sent an email. They sent an email. I, I don't this know. Place is going to they attempt. did send an email. Okay. Oh, Here's shit. the gist. Okay. Uh -huh. You need to stay here for eight hours. Eight hours? Yes. I have band practice in, I literally in like so four much hours. You need to stay here for eight hours. Yes. Can I email my? No. Teacher? Are we allowed to do anything? No. Can I go get my laptop? No. Can I invite friends? No. Your only job is to watch the goblet. Oh, Make sure no paid? one steals the goblet. What? Am I getting paid? No, you're not getting paid. Wait, so this is just like civic duty kind of thing? This is something that your school... So this is like jury duty? It's no, honorable. It's so our jury schools duty. picked us to do this? It is a very important duty. Something that freshmen traditionally do every year. All right? Yeah. All right? Yeah, I'll do absolutely. it. I'll yeah. do it, but I don't want to be with this guy. It's kind of cramping my There style. is no switching around. Please. You are in this room for the next eight hours. All right? <laughs> this is going to be a long day. I will come to get and you night. when your job is complete. And with that, he turns and exits into <sighs> the secretary's desk. Oh. oh, my gosh. I'm sorry, guys. We just, to people like that, we have to act proper. I'm bored Can already. Can you stop? You're literally failing, so like... <laughs> 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 Act <laughs> proper? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You need to get proper grades. I'm just saying. Okay, what do we do now? We watch the goblet. <laughs> and as as says that, he points to the goblet. You all look to where the goblet is, and you see that the goblet is gone. Oh, okay, <laughs> guys. Okay, which one of you took it? Wait, okay. Yeah, I yeah, think it's yeah. him. This can't, no, this I can't. I think it's him too, honestly. Like, you has to you be look here. at me the entire time. No, but you're gonna bribe the school with the goblets of the up your GPA. You're oh such a goody two shoes. So Did you guys hear that thing, Cole? <laughs> no, we weren't there. <laughs> How do you all know about my GPA? Because <laughs> <laughs> it's so obviously <laughs> written on your, your face. face. You came in looking like you had failed something. <laughs> also, the word has been going around. Yeah. I did not take it. I swear I, I would not. I, how would I have taken it? It's huge. Actually, like wait a minute. You took it because like you're all you know follow the rules, follow the rules, so that it'll look like you didn't. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's such a. This good is point. no time for conspiracy. We need to find out what happened. It's wait, not maybe you took it because you want to write a song about it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I don't. I think I just think about I, that. Exactly. Yeah, I think you just look at it. With him. Exactly. They get it. Is anything? You all should come out to my next show. Actually, we're having one in about two, two, two weeks. We're this is no time for for advertising. You, you know, you should come to Battle of the Bards too. You uh, too. No, okay. It'll wait, be a fun time. Do you guys ever like film music videos? We do actually sometimes. I mean, like I love. Everyone, wait, do you know the goblet is missing? The goblet is missing. We need to do something about this. What are Why? we going to do? We're locked in here. <laughs> what are we going to do? Anywhere. We know where it is. Well, I'm not sure. 
<laughs> no, you don't. He has it. No. Oh, okay, shit, I'm you're of, right. I'm kind of, like, agreeing a little bit with him just because I'm Thank worried you. that, like, Harvard is going to, like, kick me out if I, like, don't do well on this. So I think that we should find You go to Harvard? It. Yeah, I go to Harvard. I know. Okay. If they find out that it's gone, we are dead. <laughs> don't treat me any different. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Got Good. it. Okay. You can ask me questions, though, because I know a, a, a like. A lot. I don't but think like, I, I don't really have that's any questions. That, that really is okay. Is. Yeah, we're okay, what's our first step then? Hmm? What's what do we our do? First, yeah. Well, well, we have to try and open no, the door, I, know, I guess. I know, like, actual things. Like, okay. No, so this is problem solving, so you probably should know this. Guys, yeah. let me look around the room. Okay. I'll take a look around the room for any sort of weird things. You go ahead and do that. Small cracks in the walls, you mm-hmm. know. Well, okay, so you're you're looking around the room for any trace I'm of anything. I'm going to investigate, yeah. All right, so roll an investigation check. All right. 15. 15? Yes. Okay. Plus a one. So. So 16? Mm-hmm. All right. So you walk up to the dais where the goblet was. Mm-hmm. It's like it's like it was never there. There's no dust on the dais. It's, you, you're, you're baffled. But you notice on the floor next to the dais is a drop of blood. You just wanted to touch that? I don't know, man. I, I regret it, but I wanted to do it to be dramatic. It but, seemed to be a bad idea. I mean... Now you're Let's, just wiping it all over. I your... don't know what you want me to do with it. Dude. <laughs> oh my God. There's probably like so many germs. Okay, guys. Do you need medicine? No, I'm okay. Okay. I was just <laughs> looking at the blood. <sighs> all right, and you see, you look up from the first droplet of blood. Guys, there's blood. And you see, <laughs> you see several droplets of blood continuing oh. away from the dais. Okay, oh. guys, um, blood trail. Blood trail going all the way over there. Oh, no. It leads all the way up to <laughs> the back wall of the room, oh. and then Wait. abruptly stops. Um, okay. Why did you so, stop? guys, there's a blood trail that goes all the way to the back wall and then stops. Um, That's should pretty... we follow it? I think we should all go. Okay. Just to the wall? There's <laughs> nothing better to do. Well, maybe there's a secret passageway. I think someone should stay behind. Come on, guys. <laughs> I think we're all in agreement then. Yeah, could you stay? Could, do you mind staying back? Yeah, can back? you stay behind just in case someone behind. comes in? I know, you have to be here to at least, you know, fulfill I mean, your duty. Yeah, that, that's true. We'll okay. go out and try will, to find it. I will stay behind. Okay. But don't be long. Um, we're not going to leave, we're just going to go to the back wall. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We're just looking for a secret passage. Alright guys, let's follow this blood trail. Let's do it. Alright, yeah. you walk all of 10 feet. <laughs> To the back wall. We're here. You're so far away from Manny, it's crazy. It's like you don't even you barely can hear him. Thank God. Is that Manny back there? He was so annoying. Dude, he's such a loser. Manny, you can hear everything that they're saying. (laughs) Yeah, Yeah, I was like, I just didn't like how he came in trying to be a leader. Like, does he not know that I'm a leader in a band? (laughs) Does he not know that? Which reminds me, Battle of the Bards, two weeks, yeah. Actually, yeah, Harvard, yeah we got Harvard it. Harvard students are supposed to be, like, leaders. Like, that's how we're taught. Um, okay. We know a lot about All leadership. Right. Okay, so what do we think Harvard. about this blood? What should we do? Um, well, let's look at where it stops. All it right. stops right here. Do you want to roll another investigation check? Yeah, of course. Okay. Let's do it. Obviously. I'll look into it. You're really becoming the Sherlock Holmes of the group. 18. Sherlock Holmes. No. Sherlock knows. 18? All Natural, right. Natural 17. So you're really, you're really, feeling, you're really feeling on your game today. Mm-hmm. You're, you're, you look at the wall and you're like, wait a minute. You notice that the stone blocks that make up this section of the wall have a faint seam running in a perfectly straight vertical line. There seems to be a hidden door carved into the rock. So guys, there's a seam in the wall. You yeah. also notice a small symbol etched into the rock next to the seam. Uh-oh. What's, what's the symbol? It's just a simplistic little carving of a key. It's a little key. Key. Do you think it's telling us we have to find a key to get the gold? I could try to open it without a key. That's a good idea. Okay, well, just, yeah, just see if you can, like, push on it or something. Okay. Or, like, cast a spell or something. Mm. <laughs> should I roll for pushing on it or should I just push on it? I'm roll, I mean, roll and push on it. Okay. <laughs> Eight Jeez. Jeez. All right. Eight Jeez. Okay. You push, you push really hard. <laughs> What's your athletics? So you would add your athletics to this, too? Okay. 18 plus... Athletics. Zero. All right. Awesome. Ooh, Great. So you pu- you're pushing guy. you're pushing so hard against this hidden door, so hard, and it's just not it's not budging. It's okay, just not. I think the key means something, not, guys. Okay, so I guess not. we have to go find a key. Yeah. Then. Yeah. Um, um. So this actually reminds me of something that I learned in my history class at Harvard. Oh, would you yes. like to roll a history check? Yes. All right, roll a history check. Fifteen. Plus your history. 
plus my history plus three. All right, 18. Oh. Yes. Okay, you remember that in your ancient entrances, hidden or otherwise class, you remember that hundreds of years ago, um, magicians would create doors such as this where there would be a hidden door and next to it there would be a small symbol. It could vary. The symbol itself could vary. But usually all that they needed to do was touch the symbol and the door would unlock. I think that we should do it. All right. Do we have Fine. anyone who can do that? I'll touch it. All right. You sure? Yes. You're touching it? Yes. You're touching it. Wait. What? I think I should do it. Why? Because... Can I you reach it? Came up with <laughs> I, I came up that's, with the idea. Hey, that's not nice. That's a good question. Actually, that's, no, he can't. It's a little high up. He would need I'm some sorry, help. Yeah, I say let the Harvard lady do it. I can pick you up. I can reach it, can't I? Yeah, no, you can. You can reach it yeah. fine. Yeah, okay. You're, you're not invited to battle. Wait, I need to film it, though. You that's I true. You can do the next thing. Take it back. Yeah, you're back. All right, cool. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm going to run over to you guys. I can't even... No, we don't... Need... Oh, here we go. Guys, okay. Oh, 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 the stink is back. I could... <laughs> God, I really Looks don't like, like this Looks like PU is here. <laughs> uh, well, he doesn't go to... Where did he go again? Tufts University. Puffs. Actually, guys... PU. Guys, if F -T -S. we're going to be stuck... <laughs> okay, someone's going to Harvard. Guys, if we're going to be stuck in here for eight hours, <laughs> yeah. I think we should not be uh, mean to this guy. Okay, I'm going to touch it. All right. <laughs> I'm talking about All right, that guy. Annerald reaches out her hand it. and... It? ...touches the key symbol. And with that, the door grinds away from the wall. It, it, it was actually, it opens inwards into the room. Oh. So it's a pull. It would be a pull. Oh. oh. So oh. you, you, pull you, were you were pushing on the thing. Oh. So it opens, it opens just a, it, it opens just a bit. Yeah. Uh, so you can get your, you get your fingers in there and, and open it up more if you would Got like. Got it. Did this all happen? Do you oh, you? yes. I'm going to do that. All right. So you open it up and you see on the floor some more blood droplets. It seems that you find, found the passage that whoever took the goblet took. All right. Do we go? Wait. Is there any light in this? Hallway? No, there is no. There is no light in this. Okay. I have dark vision. As I do as well, but I I can conjure light. Oh, you can. Yes. Well, I was gonna say if we could. I was gonna say if there was any light. If how is the room that we were in currently being illuminated by? There's just sconces. Sconces. Throughout. And then there's a chandelier hanging from above. Could with, I? With light. A chandelier with light? Yes. Hmm. Oh, so is there light? There is light. There's but not in the, not no, the hallway. Okay. Not in the passageway. Um, uh, could I request your camera, as? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I, I, may, I'm going to light it up with my light ability. And so it's going to radiate light. All right, so you cast light on Az's camera. Whoa. All right. Now. Sick. It's very bright. It's just shining. It almost hurts your eyes to look directly at it. Don't look directly at it. I'm not. Okay. Well, I keep doing it. I see it. you looking directly at it. I keep doing it because I want to it. it's, see it. It's just your it camera, hurts, though. but it's light. It's, I know, don't but it's look cool at it. to look at, Okay. but it hurts. Okay. <laughs> All right, so you're standing with a lit camera and at the opening to a dark passageway. Can All I? right. Cool. Ready to go in? Yeah. Am I holding this? Am you I know what? Actually, it? guys, I, I have an idea. I would like to check for traps. Where? Okay. Using my find traps spell. <laughs> All right. So you cast find traps. Yes. All right. So you all see Manny. You, no, he doesn't need to roll I'm going to attach the camera to my... Go ahead. All right. So find traps, find traps, find traps. Do, 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 do. You kneel down. And you send a pulse of magic energy around you, just searching, uh, searching to see if there's any nefarious traps. And there are none. Oh, you okay. seem good. That's pretty good. Yeah. At least within a, uh, I believe it is a, with it within 120 feet, there's nothing. Okay. Nice. Nothing right, dangerous. Uh, so, do you guys want to walk 120 feet? Let's. I, that yeah. sounds like a great exactly plan. 120 feet. Yeah. 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 No, no, more. Yeah. No, no more. No less either. No who more. is who is counting out 120 feet? I will. All right. I think he should. Oh, oh yeah. I, I was going to well, say I can. could because I'm pretty sure. Oh, I told you that you could do the next thing. So. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You'll count it out. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. I guess we know who's the leader. I'm just remembering. Um, yeah. As you can walk, you have the light, so you go first. Okay. I'll yeah. go first. So actually, how about this? Can I get onto your back? Yeah. That way I can. This way we can like count it together. All right. Okay. So one. 
two. Okay, we don't have three. to count to 120 feet. <laughs> oh, okay. And we're there. And we're there. Did we arrive okay, 120 feet yet? Well, okay, so who was counting again? I was. It was you? Okay, so roll an intelligence check. <laughs> What's that? 14, 14, 14 plus, plus uh, two, 16. All right. So you're pretty, you're, you're pretty close to 120 feet. You're pretty close. Okay. You don't know if you're exactly there because right. while you're on someone's back. It's hard to. I mean, you're higher off the ground than you usually are. You're, you're, I know, your this is, it's of, kind of weird to see the world this way, not going to lie. It's, yeah. it's fun, right? Yeah. It is. Yeah. Do y'all do this all the time? Every yeah. day, yes. <laughs> oh, whoa. Oh, damn. Really all right. Okay. Um, I was thinking, hey, uh, Tufts boy, can you, yes. uh, can you My check? My name is Manny. Nothing. Go ahead. Can you just check to see if there's traps again? Okay, I. That is a pretty strong spell. I need to use the second out of my third slot. However, I would be willing to do that for you guys. I think uh, we should save ooh, it. Maybe we should save it. Yeah, it's worth. It's this, worth the risk. I feel like this is turning into an adventure. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's keep going. <laughs> uh, 120 <laughs> feet again? Or are we? You know what? What what do we see? How much do we see anything? Is so it, so is you've been, so you've been walking. Yeah. So yeah. so so, so it's a simple back, it's a simple carve for a second. Yeah. Just okay. like just get back down. Hey, rest my shoulders. Okay. Then. Oh Sorry. man. Sorry about very that. Very heavy for. Very uh, two, that's two rude. Foot. That was that's rude. No, I just expected rude. expected. You never ask a gnome, not gnome. Yeah, a gnome. You never ask a gnome there. You never ask a gnome. Oh wait. That's actually like really rude. That was actually pretty rude. Yeah, I'm sorry guys. Just did you not take a. A race class. So in, what do we oh, see? <laughs> so you've been walking <laughs> for nice roughly 120 feet, um, and it's just been a simple stone um, passageway that's been curving a little bit. You see, make a survival check. Thirteen. Thirteen. <laughs> Almost a one. <laughs> All right. So <laughs> from where you entered, what's your? Do you have any bonuses to survival? Uh, three. Three. Okay. So sixteen. Um. So from around where you went in to where the passage has turned, you think that you're headed back towards the common. You seem to have okay. done kind of a 180 as the various turns have affected your course of travel. Okay. But in front of you is just what appears to be a straight shot. I'm willing to say that if there weren't traps within the first 120 feet of this entrance and someone had to go through it, there aren't going to be any traps. Okay, but until we read something that looks different, I'm gonna say. All right. If it's just the same so hallway, it, it looks the same. The hallway seems to look the same, yes. All right. Um. Are you guys all down? Yeah. 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 All right. You walk forward, down this passageway, for roughly a, another hundred feet or so, before you reach what seem to be stairs. Ooh. I think we should. Go okay. On. Wait. Leading up, I should clarify. Leading up. up. Leading up. Okay, not gonna lie, I, I thought it was leading down. Okay. So this changes things. <laughs> leading up? Leading up seems to be the it end of the I'll day. go up. You'll go up? All right, so Michelle pushes past, oh, wow. starts walking oh. up the stairs. Michelle. And nothing happens. Oh. Okay. She, yeah, there's nothing there. Oh. <laughs> she seems to be the strongest of us, however. That's not true. Um, it <clears> is <throat> true. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I sent some drama, but we should just keep going, in I my opinion. I mean, I'm not going to ask you what your strength is. Uh, okay, guys, we should keep walking. <laughs> okay. All right. What this tense conversation ensues as you walk up the stairs that Michelle has determined to be safe. And you reach what appears to be a hatch. Like a hatch as in like, like one, like, oh, it's, mm -hmm. okay, thank like you. Basement. Sorry, mm -hmm. of course. I didn't mean to be, okay. You're short. Mm -hmm. I've never seen one before. Should we open it? It's pretty. Yeah. All right, who's opening it? Wait, if I someone am, just I lifts me up. I am, I'm already there. Up, I'm literally. If someone just lifts me up, <laughs> I can push there. it. I raised my hand first, though. Do you, do one of you want to raise him up? I was already there. Do one of you want to open it? Someone raise me up. Can you okay, raise me up? Okay, open it. Okay, so you push up with the hatch. Roll athletics. I hate that no one lets me do things because I'm short. I literally let you, you do the next 18. thing. 18. You Plus walking. athletics. Five. Five. All right, 23. So, Michelle. I'm pretty strong. With no problem at all. You guys are sh very impressed with how strong she is. Wow. She's very strong. Wow, good job. Lifts this slab of stone up and over. And as she lifts it up, 
daylight streams into the passage. Ow, Ow. my eyes kind of bright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It kind of kind of stunned for a second. Mine are fine because this was so bright that my eyes. Oh, it's been in your vision. Yeah. Okay, and and Michelle, as you move it to the side, um, you look up and you see, you see blue sky. Cool. And you hear the sounds of cars and people talking and Wait. birds chirping. So, I think that's Boston. I think yeah. we are back in Boston. I agree. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, do we go out? Um, how oh. are we supposed to find it with all the people out there? I mean, I feel like Can the I person who the took area? the goblet probably yeah, you see, through the Yeah, uh, you roll an investigation. Actually, no, you already rolled to find the blood. So the blood is, uh, you've been following it the whole time. Yeah. Uh, and you see next to Michelle as she's looking up through uh, this porthole that you've created into the sky. Um, there's blood on the very lip of it, smeared. Does it lead anywhere after it gets out? Well, do you climb out? You can't see what mm. exactly where you're right. you shooting you out. What else are we going to do? There's nothing else to do. Back down the tunnel? Okay, well, if, you, if you're going to climb out, can at least I go... Someone needs to pick me up <laughs> first. I can't... Yeah, Michelle, I'll, would I'll, you be willing to, to well, pick him up first? Do you, yeah. do you mind? Don't throw him. I'm fine. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a little small. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. He's I'm pretty, not going to Once again, you. He's this, heavy, you see this face? This face? It's yeah. It's getting a recording contract soon. Okay. Well, I heard that you were a little... Yeah. A little, little, he- little rock and roll. That's a little exactly a little rock and roll. <laughs> okay, let's let's, right. let's do it. Ready? You ready to pick me up? That's a good nickname for him. Yeah. Little rock, rock and little roll. Because he's little. All okay. right. Is she gonna pick me up now? She, <laughs> Michelle leans down and with no problem whatsoever, so lifts strong. you up and <gasps> brings you above her head. Whoa! And you look out, <laughs> popping onto the sidewalk of Boston, right outside the, oh. Oh, wow. right outside the state house. Whoa. Where where are we? What's going on? Uh, we're right outside the state house. We're we are outside the state house. We're two hundred feet away from the state house. Yeah, because isn't that how much we walked? Oh, around. Yeah, but we're like in front of the state we're house. We're in front of the state yeah. house because we were inside it. So, yeah. there's um yeah, people are just it looks like just another average day in Boston. Did anyone notice that there's a no hole there's in the no sidewalk? no wait okay. let me people let me investigate walking. let me investigate okay. see if there's blood right now people you see people glancing at you they don't really notice much they're like oh no I'm climbing out of this out of a you you see that the the thing that Michelle lifted off was uh what's it called sewer what's the thing that covers hatch the pot pot great no pot it's not sewer called grate? a pothole sewer, sewer, sewer grate sewer uh, grate thank oh, you sewer, sewer, sewer grate but it was there was not it was not a grate there was nothing going in it was just like a sheet of metal all right let me let me investigate the scene. Please do. Okay, you investigate the scene. Okay. Nine. Okay. Plus three, twelve. Okay. You don't see uh, the blood that Az has been talking about right away. Um, you notice a few people milling about. There's um, a person sitting on the the fence that surrounds the the state house. Someone sitting up against that. Um, they look like they haven't moved in a while. You see someone standing waiting to cross the light. Um, but they've been on their phone, so you don't know how long they've been standing there. Um, you see a, just a few people milling around, just some passers-by. Okay. The people who look like they've been sitting in the air, then maybe they saw something. Maybe. All right. Do you think we should all get out? Um, I think we should ask them. Yeah. I, I, I'll, I'll tell you what, you guys just stay. Currently, right only low post is outside. Yeah, I know all the rest of you are just you, peering you, out wait, into sec. a I thing. I think we should do buddies and stuff. I was going to say, if you want, I can go talk to some people. I don't want to, like, you know endanger y'all because okay you are very noble however i think we that we should all get out of the sewer now i think that well no because i think like, that we should have two people stay. go out <clears throat> and that so i'll go out with him why can't we be friends who to who it's time it's time to everyone here can i do it to everyone you no know, you can do it to one person at a time all right two, you, and you, well you one. also it's concentration so you can only have one going at a time damn it so who are you gonna choose um i'm gonna do it to I'm gonna do it to Drew. Okay, to Manny. To Manny. Manny, you're right. Sorry, That's Manny. Manny. Okay, so Manny. you look at you look at Manny. Why can't we be friends? Man, you feel a, a strange we magic be coming friends? over you. Why can't we be friends? And suddenly, you you really like you really like Lopos. You're willing to go along with pretty much whatever he says. Whatever this guy says, I will go along with. So roll. So what do you want? What do you what, what are you trying to convince him of? I'm trying to convince him to let me do this by myself because I want to prove to him and to everyone here that just because I'm tiny doesn't mean I can't do things alone. You guys, I'm <laughs> Okay, I'm roll, roll, roll a persuasion with advantage, so roll twice and take the higher number. 
Nine. That wasn't that wasn't too that hot. That wasn't very good. <laughs> 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 Alright. Um, plus plus four. Plus oh, four. Right. So thirteen. That's thirteen. So roll a uh, insight check. Fifteen. Fifteen. <laughs> so you're like, man, as much as I like him. This only makes me want to protect him more, and yeah. I don't feel like he should be alone up there. Because I love him. He, yeah. In a friendship way. And it's yes. not like you can do it alone. Fine. I think that the best friends should go together. Fine. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, so best Manny, Manny is climbing up out of the pothole, best yeah. saying, yeah. best friends. I must have misread. You guys have been best friends like quickly? Yeah. Mm. yeah. A little weird. Are you single? <laughs> sorry, that's... <laughs> sorry, that's... Oh my sorry, god. Sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm actually shooting a music video soon if you want to star in it. Wait, seriously? I just asked you that like a second ago. I'm sorry. And then you Can you Let's just get back to the uh, adventure I on here. I agree with my best friend. Let's we should do something. I think adventure. the strong woman should do things. I'm also strong, but this way. Ladies. I am this way, too. No, you're this, too this way. way. I'm both. <laughs> yeah, but that's wild. So am I. <laughs> okay, like, do you think we're fighting over you? Because we're not. I was wondering if we could get out of this very cramped hole. Oh yeah, come on, it's pretty nice outside. So Thank as you. you climb up, um, you all see that you are in fact on the sidewalk outside of the uh, outside of the state house, and you, Manny, feel kind of Lopus used magic on you to make to make you like him. <gasps> Oh gosh. Lamppost! <laughs> you used magic on me to make me like you. It's low post, actually. <laughs> and second of all, I had to. <laughs> I do not believe you. I'm I'm upset, but I'm holding my anger in. Do not do that again without consulting me first. Why can't we be friends? <laughs> Why can't we? Are you casting him? Yeah. You, you, okay. you feel you friends. feel magic coming in. You're not mad anymore. Like so, he's, He's okay. just, he's just, he's so good at singing. I How can you not why like this guy him? Is making a music How video. can you not <laughs> like him? Roll, roll persuasion again with advantage. Is this my no, no, not that one. Oh, there it yeah. is. Okay, sorry. Fifteen yeah. plus roll again. Four. Oh, sorry. Yeah, fifteen Fif plus four. This. All right, nineteen. All right. You know what? He's really good at singing. You, you, for, you forgive him. You forgive him. You're really good at singing. I forgive you. All right, so you look around. What are you, what are you guys doing? You're standing on the sidewalk. People are walking around you. You're, you're, just block, you're being sidewalk blockers right now. You're standing in a large group. People are having to walk around you. It's inconvenient for them. I'm Sorry, guys. You investigate? Yeah. All I'm right. going to look around for more of the blood. For more blood? Any weird trails that came out of the sewer grate. Okay. Roll investigation. One. One? <laughs> All right. You... Wait, you... Two. <laughs> Two? All right. You guys are great. Well, so that was a natural one, uh, correct? Natural yeah, one? natural right. one. You are really just fascinated with this weird, like, this just weird, like, Sharpie mark that's on your hand. Like, you haven't, it's w the strangest thing. You haven't, like, held a Sharpie or even been around one in, like, a really long time. long time. But somehow, you know, like, this is definitely Sharpie, but you just, there's, you have no idea it's how you Sharpie. got there. No idea how you All right, so he's really, really, really into this Sharpie mark on him. He's really not paying attention to anything else. Um, and then you look up and you're like, yeah, no, I didn't find anything. Uh, uh, yeah, I looked around. I didn't find anything. Okay. okay. He's yeah. useless. I was Let's wondering if we wanted head. to ask some people around if they'd seen anything suspicious. Yeah. That was a yeah. pretty big... Mm -hmm. Probably a good idea. Yeah. All right. We could check um, security cameras. That's a smart idea. Well, I don't know. We're not next to security. I think generally. we should ask the people outside first because yeah, he we'll probably escaped this way. Okay, let's do that. All um, right. Who, uh, roll investigation. Whoever, whoever's going up to the person to I'll talk to I'll do it. I'm not, I'll do it. Why? Uh, Why so you? I think he's the one who proposed it. <laughs> a nine. Okay. Okay. That was pretty trash. So. She took initiative. Uh, yeah. Michelle, are you look around and you see, uh, standing about 20 feet away, just hanging out, uh, just with with uh, with AirPods in. Um, wow, they seem cool. A looks like a high elf girl who looks to be like maybe an eighth grader, like either early high school or oh. late middle school. Um, oh, she's just she's vibing better. to some music right now. She's got like her ears, her eyes closed. Yeah. You walk so you walk up to her. What do you say to her? I say, hey, how long have you been hanging out here? <laughs> uh, she's just. 
Is she okay, so then I pull the AirPods out of her ears. You pull the AirPods out of her ears? Oh, yes. Okay, nice. as you do this, she... she what the I say, I'll give you your AirPods back if you tell me if you've seen anything suspicious around here. What? What, what do you mean, suspicious? Just like, like people pulling AirPods out of other people's ears? No, more like gory. Like... Gory? Like any bloody people around? Um... Roll persuasion. Oh. Seven. What's your persuasion? Do you have any addition? Um, two. So. Two. Nine. She says, listen, lady, if you don't give me back my AirPods right now, I'm going to go find a police officer and have you arrested. I think you should uh, ask, her, ask, her about, ask her about a goblet. Mm. Mm. I'll tell her, like, just like, it's really magical. They might want to listen. The goblet. Can we pick someone? New what goblet talk? are you talking about? Yo, I think we need to pick no, someone. No, this new. is a magical situation. I don't think what do you? Doing everything's so a. We live in a fantasy world. What are you talking about? In a magical situation. Well, That's like, just saying it's no, a situation. No, like it's special. What's special about it? The fact that you're extremely it. rude and interrupted me while I was listening to my music. I think that you Where should are your parents? I was listening to my favorite indie band, I'll Sunsetta. Say it's a Yo! That's my band! Come see you back okay, the bar. No, no wait, it. wait. Is hey, it really? Wait, he should yeah. talk to it. Oh my, oh my god. god. Wait, see, I should. Oh my god, hey! Wait, no, wait. Are you. Okay. Lo Lofos? I am. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh my yes, god. And she's, she starts, like, fangirling a little bit. Oh she's like, oh my god, oh my god. I made a band. Because of the, I love so, so, Sunset so much that I started a band at my school. It's called the Chubs. Oh my God, the Chubs! Oh. You know, you guys could actually open up for us one day. Well, but you don't you know what it sounds like. Hey, 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 it's okay, guys, please. Why did you touch my hand? <laughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> what's your name? Oh, my my name's uh, Dishell. 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 You know, Dichelle. um, you know, in order for this whole She's a little guys, hey, please, I think that we should let can him you, do his work. Can you okay. stop? Sorry. Okay, sorry. Okay, I, I Mr. Rockstar? Emphasis on the rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because oh he's a rock. Oh my god, little rock. Hey. Little rock. Stop! <laughs> hey, anyways, Dichelle, in mm -hmm. order for this whole, you know, having you open up for us kind of thing deal to work out, mm -hmm. um, the uh, the other guys in the band, they, they, they just need to make sure that we can trust you. So I just have a question to ask you. Mm-hmm. Have you seen any suspicious activity with a goblet and maybe some blood or something around here? You know, as um, you've been straight vibing. I just. I mean, I've that. I've pretty much just been vibing, but I, like a, a few minutes ago, I noticed like this this like big dude and like this big like he had like a cloak on. A cloak. And he just I noticed him across the street, and I just thought he looked. He what? just he was like. Was he holding anything? I didn't. I didn't notice any. I was just. I was vibing. Okay, but of like, course, of course. But, um, vibing to our new single. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Yeah, our new, our new song comes out soon. But, yeah, um, but <laughs> you were... Okay. And, uh, but I don't know, he seemed... Uh, the only thing that's kind of suspicious is, is that guy. Okay. Because, you know, it's like... It's warm. Why are you wearing a coat? Right, of Ask course. Where did, where did he go? Ask where he went. Do you, yeah, what, what direction was he going in? Oh, um, and she points down towards the common. Towards the okay. He says, but oh, he, he didn't go into the common though. It, I, I think he was walking along the edge of it. Okay, so you he was like around the perimeter. Okay, but why yeah. did she tell me this? I have an idea. I have, can I have my AirPods back? Can, can you oh, have? Yeah, of course. Hey. I have one. an idea. Okay, here um, you go. Thank you. Thank you, Horace. Uh, Thank you. Hey, Love you. Love I'll, you, Van. Corey's. Corey, do you want to take a picture before? <gasps> can we? Yeah, of course. All right. Um, so she gets her phone out. Do you want to take a picture? This is too much. Can I? Can I come around to you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Oh wait, no. Okay, we don't have time for this. Wait, I have a plan. Just um, act like I'm taking it. Okay. Okay. So I can see you in the show. Of course. Okay. What's your plan? Okay, so I can talk to animals, and so I was thinking. So can I? As can I. Okay, great. Um. So, I was <laughs> thinking that I there. would go talk to the squirrels that are on the top of the tops of you the look, trees. Okay, you look around and make an investigation check. That's a d12. Of course. <laughs> that, it's out there. Oh, oh okay. here she is. <laughs> 13. Oh. 13. Plus. Plus one, so 14. 14. You can do you math. You don't see any squirrels at right? the moment. Can I find that squirrel from earlier? That squirrel from earlier was that on I the. Get, that I helped. 
Get the okay, well, well, someone else, someone else who can talk to animals, <laughs> do an investigation. He's check. not. Okay, he's not around. Well. He's, he's he was on the other end of the. Can Michelle do one? Michelle, you would like to also look for a squirrel. Yeah. You would like to look for a squirrel. Okay. Roll to look for a squirrel. Oh, seven. seven. <laughs> Plus investigation. Yeah, but, uh, six. It's minus. Minus one. No squirrels for you, Michelle. No squirrels. Okay. Okay. Manny? Yeah, Manny looked for a squirrel. Yeah. I was wondering if I could look for a squirrel. Yeah. Okay. My eyes are, are trained. This is how we find things. In being very poor. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder he's not doing too well in Plus school, investigation. Right? Uh, yeah, I can't make this. Good okay. Right, guys, there's just not, there's just just no squirrels around. It's a six. Guys, just... you guys don't know how to look for a squirrel. You seem to know <laughs> so how to look for a squirrel. So why don't you stand back and let me show you how to look for a squirrel. As like gestures for space. Like okay. he's, please, of course, guys. Of I'm going to look for a squirrel the right way. Oh! oh. We got 17. 17, okay. okay. Watch this. Watch, um, him, watch him learn. You you see in the distance in the common, you see some squirrels yeah. uh, running around in a tree. They're pretty far away though. Make a make a nature check. Nature check. V yeah. Vibe check. Nature check. Will give me. Oh well, it's kind of sideways between, between nineteen and well, it's nineteen. Uh yeah, actually no, I would say that's cocked. You can roll again. Cocked? Yeah. What? You it's, wouldn't say nineteen? It's no, it's it's a little cocked. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Almost had a nineteen, guys. Almost had a twenty, actually. He just got cocked. That's a three. A, that's it. Makes a three. Okay. He did. Um, okay. You know what, man? Uh, you're you really, you this. really don't know if the squirrel saw anything. Do you want me to do a nature check? For for what? <laughs> We're just gonna do the same check. <laughs> Guys, you're spending so much oh, time oh, on squirrels right now. I love it. Can I? Yes. Talk. I can talk to a bird. Can I roll you, for? I We're just looking for a different All right, animal. So you're looking for a bird now. <laughs> yes. Where are y'all finding right. out what, where you who you can talk to? We just know. I have, um... got an eight. You got an eight. Okay, you see no birds. Um, Can I check for um, an eagle? That's a bird. Okay. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Can I check for... And how likely is there to be an eagle in Boston? <laughs> You'd be okay. surprised. Where are you seeing you can talk to animals? Okay, <laughs> it's so a spell. You can. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. it's a spell? Yes. Oh, why did you say that? Okay. <laughs> okay, wait. Can I roll to see if there is any chipmunks? <laughs> okay, okay, wait. Time out. Is there a better way to do this? Okay, okay, wait. Just going through all the city animals. Oh, wait, Before you roll, you roll for a bird. A okay, wait, 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 wait. Why can't we be friends? Why I'm to, taking that away from I'm doing to, it to her now. Okay. Why can't we be friends? I make an executive decision that we instead just walk towards the squirrel in the distance, like we were originally planning to the do. The squirrel that's not even nowhere close to where the guy was seen. Oh, or was he wasn't. Walking. Never mind. Let's just keep following along the perimeter. Okay, so you're gonna Did walk you that direction. Did you put a spell on me? Why can't we be friends? Okay. Why and now, Ella, you, and Ralph, you're like, why can't we be friends? Shut up! Why can't, Shut up! I'm. Why can't we be friends? Yo, I, I only okay, have. So let's why can't we? Let's just go around the <laughs> perimeter, okay? Uh, oh! I used her one answer. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I think because you of that, we should go around the perimeter. <laughs> I think we should go around the perimeter. I'm so sorry. I agree with him. Can we? Can I do something like, like, I grab a squirrel, I levitate it in the air, someone talks to it while it's up there to see if it sees anything at 360 degrees. I can, I can turn into a squirrel. Okay. <laughs> you can turn do into we want, a squirrel. I can turn into an animal. Okay. Wait, and then, what? And then climb up a tree or wait, on a He's a druid. No, you, wait, he's wait, a druid. Wait, this wait, makes sense. Well, he said he can talk to the squirrel. What happened to walking around the planet? Here's the thing. Here's the thing. No, you guys bird, are so good up. at this game. I can fly. Well, fly. <laughs> Y'all, we are can literally you? in All right. the same as you're, spot. As you're, as you're standing outside <laughs> arguing, you hear, make it, make a perception check. Perception all of us? Check. Yeah, all of you make a perception, perception check. check. Perception check. Perception check. Eight, baby. Eight. 19. Oh my god, I got twins. I have, I have 13 minus one, so 12. Plus, my perception <laughs> is 22. One. So you made a 22. Yeah. So, Manny, you yeah. hear your keen ears. You hear coming from the state house. Oh, Sounds no. like alarms. <gasps> <laughs> I think I just heard some alarms coming from the state house. And it sounds like they might have discovered that the goblin is missing. And it sounds like they might have discovered that the goblin is missing. They and did not. you're missing, so they would only oh, assume. No. They think that we stole a goblet! 
Oh, well, we can get blood it. samples. Oh, I don't know if that's should good I collect, evidence. Should I collect in a vial a blood sample? <laughs> I think that means that Do we you have, have a vial in your in, in your inventory. Us, I will yo, no. yo, no, we gotta just run. Come, no, we have to run. We, we have to run. But someone carry me because I can't run fast. Wait. Also, though, if we come back Jesus with the goblet, God. they're gonna think that we were the ones that took it. That's true. So we should go back. We should go back, show no, them that we don't have no, it. No, we can't. We no. have to find you could bring it. The perpetrator, you could bring the perpetrator with you. That's true. We need to go. Let's go that same direction that that, oh. that suspicious man was going. We can run there, see if we see anything. At the same time, we can get far away from the state house. All right. Can someone carry me? I can. Okay. Are we, are we ready? <laughs> All of us? All right. Yeah. You're running. All right. You're running? Okay, you stop to wait because you, it, you have to cross it. The cars are going. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh my this right. is the most so you wait for like situation. you wait for like five seconds okay. and then you keep running <laughs> across the intersection as the light goes. Classic Boston. Um, you're running, you're running, you're running. Does anyone have an investigation check I do. For, for, for the blood? See if they're you're following the 18. 18. 18. 18. Oh my god, right. we're so close. We're so you close. You look down, you look down as you're running, you see the blood trail, it's back. Oh my god. You keep running, you keep running. Keep running. You keep running around the perimeter, around the perimeter. You keep running and eventually you stop. As you arrive at what appears to be an entrance to the abandoned Boston T system. Hey, put me down. Oh. All right. <laughs> okay. You see, looking around for more signs of the blood, you see some blood on the door leading down into the T station. He was here? Oh, okay, well. And with that, we will end our first episode with our characters, our party banding together and arriving at the T-Station. We'll see you next time on Boston.